Hi, Cancer. Um, okay, so this is a special reading for my Cancer women. And it's going to be titled, How Does He View Me? Um, it's a set of six questions. Um, these questions have... Um, I came up with these questions by talking to some of my um, married male friends. Um, a lot of times I have a lot of female um, subscribers and uh, just females requesting readings and they want to know about you know how their significant other feels they don't know what questions to ask um, these are questions that I asked my married uh, male friends these were questions that helped them determine you know um, who they would who they chose as their wife so these this is um an example or a sample of the reading that you can purchase is called how does he view me so let's get started um, I did it for Aquarius also I'm gonna do it for all 12 signs so the first question is <clears throat> is he physically attracted to me so that's a question you would want to know you know because a lot of times sometimes people are with people for different reasons uh good and bad so you do want to know is your significant other now keep in mind this is a general reading so it's not going to be the energy of every cancer female who comes to the reading but you can request your own personal reading and get these six questions asked asked for you and your significant other so is Cancer's significant other physically attracted to them. Let's see. The judgment card. Alright. Judgment card talks about and the will of fortune. Okay. The judgment card talks about um <clears throat> of course second chances and, and life cycles and it talks about accurate judgment with without the rose colored glasses um, and then we have the will of fortune a lot of times when I'm doing spreads for um, person you know personal readings the will of fortune comes up next to the eight of pentacles or the judgment card this talks about someone might need to um, think about getting um either revamping how they look getting a makeover or you may want to even think about working out you know um instituting some type of workout regimen so i don't think that cancer's partner is 100 percent you know not attracted to them but they want you to take care of yourself they still love you it's just more so about you know they've seen the best of you and you have to be honest with yourself are you at your best all right so the next question is he intellectually stimulated by me intellectual stimulation is cancer's partner intellectually stimulated by the hey and we have the emperor in the reverse um, they may think that you're a bit stuck in your ways um, in regards to some of your foundational, traditional thought patterns. They may feel like you don't think outside the box um, or outside of your box. And, and it's okay if you want to. Yeah, hip her in the full. So. They may be, they think that sometimes you're stuck. Sometimes you're, you're, you're rigid in doing things your way and which they may deem it as foolish or not well thought out. They may even think that your, your um, intellect is on the childish side, on the more immature side, or the more um, naive or um, innocent. 
So, um, okay. So, the next question is, does Cancer's significant other um, see them as someone who will get along with their friends and family? Does Cancer's significant other see them as someone who will get along with their friends and family? Page of Wands, yeah. Um, they look at you like, okay, you can bounce around in any, any and all circles, you know? Um, sometimes the in your energy is a little bit immature or maybe there's not a lot of knowledge of you fill in the blank the queen of wands yeah they feel like you're very charismatic outgoing you're you're attractive um physically and energetically um you know a lot of people or people gravitate towards you because of that that um that zest for life that the page of wands has you may even dress very nice in which people are gravitated you know people gravitate toward toward you for just that reason um, so they do see you as someone who gets along with their friends and family um, they see you as kind of possessive too you know maybe possessive of your friends and your family um, let's see so the next question is can cancer significant other see himself marrying cancer can he see himself marrying you cancer all right i'm gonna go with it three jumped out the moon the world and the eight of wands They feel like you still have some open doors and there's some things that they don't know about every aspect of your life. Sometimes they, they're even questioning sometimes your your thought patterns and your mental capacity and or or whatever, something in regards to that. Or just feeling like there's some secrets in and or some some doors still open. Um there might even be like some emotional issues here. They they feel like that about you. They now the thing about it is, yes, that's a concern for them. They feel once like once you get over that, or once you close doors, or once you deal with that energy, then you guys can have a new cycle with the world here, and things can progress and move forward. And the this is this card is nicknamed the arrows of love. So. You know, maybe moving forward into, you know, marriage and long-term commitment can happen once cancer deals with, um, gets in control of the light and the dark, the good and the bad, the, the emotional, um, side of things. Maybe some, some of you need to learn to be truthful and honest about, um, things that, uh, or in regards to you know the relationship all right does he feel like you guys are sexually compatible or does he feel does he feel like um, cancer is sexually compatible with him let's see okay. six of swords yeah he feels like there's balance and there's there's a level of um, there's high energy here, and a level, but at the same time, a level of peace. Um, it just works. It fits. It, it feels familiar, and it feels um, serene. They can be themselves with you, or they feel like they can open up with you. Is is Cancer's partner sexually compatible? Wow, yeah.
for some of you it feels like this person feels like yes the sexual compatibility is there um it took a while or for some of you it's that the sexual compatibility is there but they want to get to a place of feeling at ease they want to get to a place of feeling like they can offer themselves completely in sexual activity and not feel as if they're holding anything back there's some blockages here it might have something to do with maybe cancer soldier. I don't know request this reading for yourself so you go into you know more more in depth and it's your energy this is general yeah so this could be for anybody um okay does so the next question and the last question is does cancer's partner or does he view me as financially responsible does he view does he view cancer as financially responsible does he view me as financially responsible okay two cards popped out Ooh, the tower the seven of swords I'm going to take this one four of swords your partner cancer may view you as um, there there's some abrupt change or there is abrupt change so now you're really trying to devise a plan of action to recover whatever was lost in regards to finances or you're really in a recovery and a recouping stage here with the four of swords and the seven of swords um, you may even be looking out for self right now in regards to um, your finances because there was some abrupt change here do they view you as financially responsible they may view you as um, yeah you're waiting um, cancer, they may view you as, they view you as, um, something happened here. There might even have been an abrupt career change or job loss. And you had to lean on them in which they kind of, maybe some of, for some of you, they even felt like you were, um, out for self. Or devising a plan of action where it could be better for yourself, for you. Because you're trying to recover whatever was lost. You're the, at a place of just doing, just to maintain here with the hangman. Altogether, I would say no, not right now. They don't feel they don't feel like you're financially are responsible and or they feel like you know this could be the adverse you know, um, you may feel this way about that about your partner uh, or whoever you came to the reading for but it would have to be no not right now they feel like you're in recovery okay so this is the reading for cancer um how does he view me keep in mind as general if you want your own guided reading six questions or your own energy you can always request that over at my website you will go to um the book online video recorded readings it's only video recorded you cannot get this live video recorded and it's sent to you you can watch it as many times as you want this is how your partner views you, general energy cancer. I hope that this message gave you a bit of clarity. If it did resonate with you, get down in the comments below. Um, know that this is how your significant other is viewing you. Um, if you feel like it's true to you, then do whatever you need to do to, I don't know, tweak it or if it's okay, if you're okay with it, great. I don't know. It's just general energy. 
All right. Um, now that I'm praying for you, Cancer, pray for me as well. Go over to the website, look around. Um, get this person, get this reading for yourself. All right. Take care, guys. Bye.